Président. Vice President, do we call for the Council's attention to the situation of indigenous peoples, in particular indigenous peoples denied their right to land? The real human rights question, the vital question, is the territorial question. In history, indigenous peoples have undergone extermination, plans to be exterminated from their lands, such as in the Native Americans and the Armenians. These genocidal programs have never really ceased. What's more, because those people are cut off from their land, either due to the effects of globalization or because transnational companies come in and illegally take over the land of the American Indians, submitting them to a deadly slavery and forcing them into exile, or due to a genocide that forces the population into exile, as is the case with the Armenian people, whose land, in other words, Eastern Armenia has been occupied since 1920 by the Turkish occupying forces. Solutions do exist to put a stop to the, uh, put a stop to this, and here the Human Rights Council should support the working group on developing a binding code of conduct on transnational companies. Solutions also exist for ensuring the right of return for the indigenous Armenian people to their land by applying all of the Sevra treaties. It's a, a peace treaty which is still in act and which effectively closed the First World War and would bring a solution of peace to the war in the Middle East. Thank you. Association, joint statement. Merci, Monsieur le Président. Thank you. Education of children, even during war,